what the siren's all about. I heard them. I definitely heard sirens. Oh god, that's why. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> why? Why do I always have to have a big forest fire? Oh. Look at it. Look, oh, look at this big black area where it's just torn its way through. Oh, this is horrific. Um. Okay, do you know what? I don't even know what to do there. We've got the fire helicopters, but they're not doing anything apparently, so... What a shame. Uh, anyway, folks, welcome back to our Salmon Rivers. I know it's been a long time since I've played this one. But, it's fine. I suppose if you're patient enough with me, we can, uh, we can crack on and get some, some more jobs done here. Um, I wanted to expand this into an, more of an office area, which was our next job, believe it or not. Because I've got a big demand for industry. What roads are I using? I was using this with the palm tree in the middle. <sighs> my uh, my potato computer is truly showing now. I'm not gonna lie, it really is because this game is quite intense. And unfortunately, little potato PC just can't take it. Come on, I'm trying to move one step, thank you. And then we might have a little path in that area, I suppose. Oh, hang on. Wow, okay, so we're level 5 um, forestry. That kind of came out of nowhere. Just to add some effect. I'm going to go to some smaller roads. Can that go out to there? Can it really go out that far? It can now. <clears throat> the buildings might not be able to get quite there, but... That's good enough for me. Small road connecting that? Does that work? Kind of, I suppose. I don't actually want that there, but... Well... That will do. Let's, Let's install the water. Our well, water availability is looking a bit crap at the moment. So I'm gonna have to. Oh, if I expand down, I might be able to get a new. Let me spit. Ah. Uh, What happened? Did that did that just not connect? I don't think it connected, that might be why. I have to use goddamn road anarchy for pipes under the road. How stupid can you get? Thank you. <coughs> Excuse me. It's the uh, dreaded salmon cough returning. Oh wait, hang on, I might want to go up here as well. Why is the space already occupied? It should not be. I need to bulldoze this crap. Ah, that's better. Right, then if I can connect it to that bit again. Alright, thank you. So, I want to zone all this as office, to be fair. Um, 
I just want it to be a huge office area. I'm gonna have what paths? What paths was I using? I can't really remember. I think I, these are just paths with trees. I think I just used plain paths dotted around. So that's what I'm gonna do. All right, hang on, because right, I need to remember how to play this damn game now. Snapping off anarchy on. I want curved flood wall. Oh, hang on, I'm not doing flood walls, am I? No, I should hope not. I should be doing freeform one, shouldn't I? There we go, that's a nice little path. But, I don't like these little um, gaps I seem to have created. So I'm just going to ever so slightly tweak that. A nice little path coming off behind there. Do you know what? Um, well, we will have those gaps actually. They don't look that bad when they're put in the right place at least I suppose. have that path connects there and then when some buildings finally start going up properly I'll fill in some trees there right and I think it's time to open up to a new expansion almost where's my I can get a pulp mill now can't I Biomass pellet plant, engineered wood plant, I don't think I actually have one of those. Pulp mill. Raw forest products to produce paper. This doesn't have to be in the forestry area apparently. Let's put it there. That's 30k. But, but we can produce paper now. Okay, not enough raw materials apparently, according to these guys. So, probably want to put down. What's that? Large tree sapling field. That's a fence. Where's the large tree field? Large tree plantation. That just kind of touches the road ever so slightly. Okay, so we have some large tree plantations. Wow, do you know what? That's fine. Look, it just barely touches the road. How's that fire coming on? Oh, it seems to have... Oh, it's gone out. What's this? Disaster response unit. A building in the city has been destroyed. Oh, no. Oh, no. What happened? Wow. Kind of looks like a barren wasteland down here. That's <laughs> really not nice. Um, I'm just going to sweep that under the rug. Everybody's still going to school, you know. Everyone's still using my path like I said they would. Brilliant. What's this? Not enough buyers for products. Why not? Why are there not enough buyers for the products? Oh. I don't want this traffic build up again. Um, so overall, how's this doing? Overall profit, 1,000. One At least it's a profit, what else can I say? Um, <clears throat> I was looking for the natural railway. And the closest I can get is there. We're going to buy up this space here. Do you know what? I think for now that's the only one we're going to buy up.
yeah. For now, for now, that's the only one we're going to buy up. Because the actual plan... Hang on. And I expand this district to include the offices. Just like that. Brilliant. Um, because we're going to work on a new district. I'm going to have like this little. Oh, game's tanking. I really like this. This town center promenade city center. Well, okay, vehicles are still here, but it's because they're making deliveries to shops. This is the sort of thing I want. And. But I just want it to be a bit bigger than this one. Because that's not huge. There's already a lot going on in the city. As we can see, it's like some offices and retails split around, and then most of this all around the edges. Oh god, no. Oh god, please, no. It's happening again. <laughs> I'm never picking a tropical pl a tropical climate for this game again. It's too hot, forest fires start too easily. It's all these goddamn trees. But the trees look beautiful. Anyway, it's all housing like around the edges. So but I want a new little city centre esque area. Six lane road with decorative trees. Oh, okay. Space already occupied. Wait, what is that? Is that a school? It is a school. Sorry, school. That's already where it was. Alright, hang on. We're going to have to move the Firewatch Tower ever so slightly. Ever so slightly, just so that I can move this up and destroy somebody's house. Sorry. I'm a terrible mayor. I'm not going to lie. Right. I'm going to put snapping back on. There we go. Let's have a nice... Uh, how long do I want this road to be? Because this city centre... Hmm, I don't, I don't know, I can't quite decide. It's not going to be too big. Let's go f six, 70. 70 units for this large road. The uh, design element here might be a bit difficult. This is awkward. This is like the spine road, isn't it, I suppose. Right, I'm going to leave you guys with my time lapse. <laughs> While I take some time out to design this city. And hopefully I'll see you back shortly once this section has been planned out.
So I'm just <clears throat> stopping in to inform you folks, I'm just up in the water supply. Down here on our little new coastline, I'm putting in some new water treatment plants. Specifically some eco water treatment plants. People will never know the difference. And of course, we also just need to make sure these are actually connected to the grid. So this new area is officially Chestnut Hills and I'm quite happy with this mess. It feels a little bit organic, especially when it's all filled out with all these tiny, I say tiny, they're not all tiny, it fills out with all these little shops. I'm pretty sure it will feel like an organic, like old city centre. The next things I need to look at, so as we say, I've improved the water condition. Um, Chestnut Hills actually needs its own hospital. And I'm just going to plonk that. Hang on, have we still got anarchy on? We have. Chestnut Hills needs a hospital, and I need to plonk it somewhere on a main road as such. So those guys don't really have access to a hospital. I guess I could put a clinic down there. So we've got a new hospital there. I'm going to put a health clinic up here in this corner. To help for the general access to healthcare. Do you know what? I'm also going to put a clinic down here near town centre. Is that a cemetery? Is that a cemetery? I think it is. Um, but we're going to need some crematoriums. So let's just make sure they're available. And I'm going to put one in the estate as well. I know it sounds terrible, but community pool, sports hall and gymnasium. I think community pool is something people will enjoy. They're right here at the end of that big road. Uh, fire station. We need a fire station because all these trees are very flammable. Right there, like so. Wonderful. At our 
Nokia. We've been making the best in mobile phones for over 20 years. And then I'm going to put a very small fire station there. You think your phone is ringing. Shush with the ringtones. Police headquarters. That's going to go opposite there. There's a big police station in the centre of the town centre. Is that really as far as they can go? Surely that's not as far as they can go. Let's have one there as well then. At least they can sort of get in and out around town. I guess. No, we still don't have a prison. Or a police helicopter depot. That's fine, I guess. So... I'm dropping a school there. Primary school there, sorry. I'm dropping a primary school next to the hospital. Probably not the best place for one, actually. High school. What if we go for an Institute of Creative Arts? Ooh, a public library. This is a new item with a uh, with the campus expansion, I believe. And I don't entirely know. But why don't we put one in? Here we go, let's add. I love libraries, finally. I have unrestricted access to information from many different sources. Well, enjoy it, dude, while you can. Institute of Creative Arts. There's also one there, I think. Apparently. So, like, the high school coverage is massive. Elementary school, not so much, but we don't need the space. University. I think it is... Oh, hang on. I have a university. I didn't realise I had a university in here. So, how about a modern technology institute instead? I know it's a lot bigger. Yeah, why not? There you go. So there's your education covered, ladies and gents. Where's the bus depot? That's the bus depot. Um, so, hang on. Show me my bus lines. There are no bus lines in the city. That's fine, because we've got Metro. However, I'm going to want some bus lines in the city. Um... And the bus station is going to be right next to your Institute of Technology. And I'm sorry, but yes, there's also going to be a bus depot behind it. Yeah, yeah, intersections, blah, 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 blah. I get it. Um, no, we don't want trams here. I'm going to stick with Metro because it seems to be amazing at what it does. Plunk. What I want to try and do is keep the metro stations away from the university. Then they'll be forced to use the bus station. Then we'll actually have people wanting to go on the bus. Correct? Yeah, I think that sounds right to me. I need to fit a station in here. Sorry, your building's going. Please don't hurt me. So I've got a new little circular route, and I also want a drop off, like in the very centre of there. Maybe one up here as well. So that's our new metro. I will just uh, so let me connect these up to the grid. Uh, gradually will get very frustrated with me otherwise won't they
There you go, guys. Eventually, you will spread the wonder of power together. Yep, that's fine. Oh, wait, no. It's not fine. It's not fine. It's fine now. Is it? Slope too steep. Oh no. There we go. That works. Oh no, there's people dying. Have we recovered from our forest fires? We definitely have. Right, okay. I'm pretty sure people will hate living next to a football stadium, but it's going there. We'll manage with that in a moment. Lazarus Plaza. That's what I got up here. Plaza of the Dead. Which one's this? Come on, show me. Statue of Shopping. Oh, okay. How big is this? Kind of big. Might fit nicely here. There, right in the centre, look. So yeah, we're doing some good adding our landmarks. What's that? Posh Mall. Courthouse. Oh, the colossal order offices. That'd be good to have the tax office. Seeing as we are becoming a fully fledged city, I think it's important we now have a tax office. No, not the oppression office. I don't think we need an oppression office. Not just yet, maybe. And some of these are getting a bit too fancy for me. I might want to fill out. See, the Mall of Moderation is not so posh. The Mall of Moderation belongs over here in the little town, not the sea. But I don't want to do that to them. We should have the posh mall instead. But... Really, there's nowhere to put it. Well, we're just going to leave that for now. Oh, no! Not another fire. Is that a fire station as well? No, it's not. Well, whatever.
hello. The ferry. Cruise ship. Hmm. We need more offices. More places for people to work. So, let's have some waterfront offices. Why not? There you go. Lots of space for lots of new offices. And then I'm probably even going to fill in this area eventually. Uh, anyway, let's have a look at our sports team. Go team! It is Salmon Rivers Football Club. Oh, pardon me. Ticket price. Let's lower the ticket price just a little bit. We want people to come here. So the next match is in... No, 20 days. So I'll have to make sure we uh, we win this one. Yeah, I'm happy with red for the team colour. It's close to being a salmon. What what's this person angry about? Oh, they're sick. Nice pollution, I guess. This is filling out nicely. All these people on their bikes. See, this is where I wish my PC wasn't just a pure potato, because then this would look nice. I mean, it does, it does look nice, but I think it would look better. It is a shame that I have a potato over a laptop that can just about sustain this game in its current form. Because I think that's a beautiful sight to behold. People enjoying their city centre. Like, what's people going to the mega shopping centre to buy hair dye or, like, the latest video game, City Skylines 2.0? Yeah, I'm really talking out my ass. Just uh, ignore me, never mind. Are people actually demanding industry rather than. No, they want offices. But I've offered them offices. Maybe there's not enough people to work here. Oh goodness. Um, it's really I wanted Chestnut Hills to start filling out. We might have to rezone a little bit. Wait, Strawberry Meadows is level 3. We'll get to that in a moment. Um, seeing as nobody has set up shop here. I like housing, I suppose. Can we not just have the waterfront for offices? Very expensive office locale. Very good for all the uh, the budding tech students, shall we say. Want to work in all these offices? Well, now you've got a great view while you do it. That's if anybody wants to work here. Alright, I'm very quickly going to set up a few bus routes.
in our next installment, we're going to focus on building like a little bit of a skyscraper den, I suppose you could say. Hang on, because I forgot to do this earlier during a little time lapse session. I forgot to do this. Just forgot to put these roads in. And I mean, it's not much, I know, but. Oh, hang on. Hang on a minute. What's to do, Mr. Bus Line? We have a problem. What's doth be our problem? So, can we please, hang on, City Park, let's add, the, did I ever add that chess, chess, is it, yeah, Park Chessboard, did I ever add this? I don't think I did. Well, let's do it then. Oh, uh, prop and tree anarchy's on. No, prop and tree anarchy's on. I can't remember which one it was. To turn prop and tree anarchy off. No, that's the city advisor. Is it control alt P? No, it's not. That's prop it. Ah, uh, somebody help me. I want to turn my tree anarchy off. Sh shift P? Ah, yes, yeah, shift P. Brilliant. Got it. No, that was over rather quickly. Right. Now I can place my chessboard. Wonderful. Because we hadn't placed that. People can come and play chess with giant chess pieces. Looking for a chess mate. Somebody's on Chopper. Somebody go play chess with that man. Info booth. We already had those. Park pier. Well, we don't have a lake in this park, really, do we? So, but we are going to add some gazebos. We got given them, we're going to make some use of them, damn right we are. We put quite a few of them in actually, because I like them. I like having gazebos. Who doesn't like having a gazebo? Hang on. Wrong side of the damn park. You can go there. That will do. So we've added some improvements to Strawberry Meadows. Let's have a look. These like nice little gazebos look. This is nice. I'm pretty sure people love this park. I like this park. I thought I was quite happy with how we uh, how we did it. And there's even a skate park here. I forgot about this. Is anybody using it? There are. There's somebody skating on it. There's a few people skating on it. That's brilliant. So our city centre has sort of expanded as I wanted it to. It's not perfect yet. But we are growing so I think we've added a nice chunk there and I am going to sign off in a moment but first I'm just gonna purchase these two squares because this is the area we're gonna fill out next and this will be like rounding off the coastline of salmon salmon rivers if you know what I mean that sort of makes sense because if you look now, we've just got a big line. But we want to try and fill out this space of the city. And come round the coast. We'll have the, like, these, like, coastal offices. will like, follow the front, follow the waterfront along. Let's go into cinematic camera. Like, my potato needs a break. I think it's, uh, it seems to have been a little bit battered. Me playing this game for just over an hour. Well, it's been longer than an hour, really, hasn't it? God, I don't even know how long it's been. Oh, look, this is the nice town we started with. How wonderful. The frame rate is not wonderful, however. I do apologise for that.
Let's get a nice little view of what we have created. And I really, really like this game for that. That's just a really poor shot. It's a shame that the cinematic camera does sometimes pick some crap. This is just an industrial estate. Which one it is, I don't know. I think it's the industrial estate in the town, not the city. Oh, look, some buses. I think that's along the new road we've just finished building. Purple and green buses. I say we've just finished building, we'd not be like, oh, oh, see, now this is a good shot. This is a good shot where you can see the city. That's just opposite side of Strawberry Meadows. Whoa, you were spinning a bit fast then. When it does provide you with a good shot, look at that skyline in the background. Damn it, if I had a good PC, that would have looked brilliant. Where was that? I want to recreate that shot. Well, I mean, you can kind of see it from the wind farm. No, not cinematic camera. It was here, wasn't it? It just sort of spun over. Now, if my... I would just imagine all this in the background being in some high detail. And it would look really good, I think. It looks better if I zoom out, really. But... Kind of don't. It's not fun. See, you're right. Now, the things that are bothering me are the inorganicness. Does that make sense? So, this bottom line here, around this little town, it's just a bit square, and that's probably one other thing to work on before we finish the series. And, obviously, this, that's just a straight line because of where we were out of bounds. Um, and we'll go, we'll go from there, but we'll see. But, um... Really, guys, thanks for joining me for this one. I bet you probably weren't expecting to see this out anytime soon, but... Well, I want to get it finished. And I say finished, obviously, I, to finish a series of this... If you look at all those other guys out there on YouTube, they do it ten times better. By finish, I mean, I just want to... Oh, hang on. Oh, we're a, we're a colossal city. Oh, it's 42,000 population, that's why we're so close. We can get a nuclear power plant. <laughs> um, yeah, so, like, there's loads of other guys I've watched out there. Like, there's, there's plenty of people. I, I don't even have to name anybody. If you just search City Skylines, you'll find loads of YouTubers who are really good at this. Um... I'm loving doing it from an aesthetics point of view, and I've watched so many other people's Let's Plays to get an idea of sort of what I want to go for. I'm happy with what we've got, but I, I put up on Facebook that my computer just can't handle it at the moment. We're getting further and further towards the point, like, closer and closer to 100,000 population and I think 100,000 population is where my computer is going to say nope I've had enough especially while recording so it's more so like physical actual physical limitations if I didn't have said limitations then we'd probably just play this until until I could say we're done and we've completely finished the city and fill out all the space we get but I'm going to cut it short purely because of said physical limitations. Anyway, I've ranted enough. I've talked a lot of rubbish. I just hope you've enjoyed the episode. I hope you've enjoyed the nice, sizable expansion we've done there. And I'll see you next time when we're going to sort of do the same. And we're going to finish filling out that space over there. I don't know why I paused. Thank you very much, folks. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.